Well, the anticipation is over, and now the big day is here. It's the final of the UEFA Europa League. I'm Derek Ray, and as always on these big occasions, I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. We're on the cusp of kickoff. It is Manchester United facing Villarreal. Well, the long road from the start of the competition almost a year ago to the final is here. Both teams had the added advantage of if they win this competition, a Champions League place is available. Bruno Fernandes. Juan Bissaka. Throw-ins given. Moy Gomez and Alcázar. Well, he's a player who just seems to get better and better. I'm talking, of course, about Bruno Fernandes. Lee, what do you think we'll see from him in this game? Well, he's got amazing finishing ability. And when a player's got that, it means you have to go that extra yard tighter. And when you do that, you leave space behind you. So it puts the defender in two minds. Every pass hitting its target. And possession given away. That's very effective, good, high pressing. Maguire. Here's Luke Shaw. Rashford. Here is Fred. And he read it well defensively. And that's going to be the goalkeeper's ball. Disappointing control, and they've lost the ball. And United couldn't keep possession. Chukweze. Gaspar. Really good interception. Scott McTominay. Cavani. Bruno Fernandes. Edinson Cavani now. Giving the ball away. Parejo. And here's Gerard Moreno. Really getting stuck in defensively. Opportunity in the wide area. Fred. Well, no stopping him. McTominay. And a chance to whip it in here. Cavani. That's well blocked. Chukweze. And Mario Gaspar. Marcus Rashford. Harry Maguire now. Shaw. Fred. Cavani. Bruno Fernandes has it. Cavani. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Moy Gomez. United have it once again. Scott McTominay. And Mario Gaspar. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. He's protecting it effectively. Gaspar. Well, the first half of this Europa League final is in the history books. And I think it's fair to say, Lee, the game needs...
the quest for Europa League success and the second half of this final is underway Manu Trigueros it's with Parejo Manu Trigueros has it Well, as you can see from the possession, there's little between these two teams. It's been a real tight, cagey affair. You just hope it opens up a little, that one of these teams is willing to take a few risks. Fred. Scott McTominay. Good movement. Well, let's see about the cross. Well cleared away. It might be perfectly set up for the counter-attack, you know. Moy Gomez. And here's Gerard Moreno. Moreno. Manu Trigueros has it. Alcacer. It's opening up for them. Read it well. Good tackle. Relentless high-pressing. Marcus Rashford. Bruno Fernandes has it. Well, they just let his opponent glide by. And there to intervene. his strength to shield the ball as clean as a whistle that challenge bodies forward and the break looks on Cavani Scott McTominay excellent challenge Now Parejo, Pedraza, crossing possibilities, Parejo, here's Moreno, well no way through, Greenwood, Rashford in the middle, lack of guile with regard to that cross, goalkeeper's ball, Given away by Manchester United. On the attack, is there to be late excitement? It comes to absolutely nothing. Maguire. Here's Luke Shaw. Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. Crossing possibilities. Well, doing the job defensively that time. Manu Trigueros. On the ball, Chukwese. One minute remaining. What can they do from here? Chukwese. And Mario Gaspar. They cannot be separated here, and it's on to extra time. Position for Villarreal. Understandable that fatigue might set in. A strength sapping night for all concerned as the first period of extra time begins. Scott McTominay. Losing possession. Pedraza. And here's Gerard Moreno. 
and scope for them to produce something exciting great challenge he got nothing but ball this might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity and they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move Raul Albiol and Mario Gaspar Parejo now with Alcata Moreno Coquelin here's Moreno and putting his body on the line one minute of stoppage time has been added on And the first period of extra time comes to an... Well, the drama continues to unfold. Second period of extra time now. Pedraza. It's just a natural reader of the game, Fred. Matic Lindelof now no not the best challenge Rashford and the snuffing out of the cross there and a chance for Manchester United now from the corner late on in this game It's a short one, pulls it back. That's a fairly easy save for any keeper to make. Five minutes left of the second period of extra time. If nothing changes, it will be decided by means of a penalty. Must take the lead here. A colossal goal. And could it be the goal that will give them the trophy? Well, all you've got to do now, Derek, is not concede and the cup is theirs. Easier said than done, though. Well, Derek, that tells you all you need to know about this group of players. Great team spirit, fantastic stuff. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. And he takes full advantage of the time he's given. It's an accomplished finish, too. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. Well, he's delighted, isn't he? We can see that. Calm is needed now just to consolidate this lead. Cool heads. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Parejo. Just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Well, getting it forward, but they need an equaliser. And options in the centre. And there's the whistle. This UEFA Europa League final has been decided. Disappointment on one side, but sheer jubilation on the other. And my goodness, Lee, they deserve it. Absolutely deserve it. They were running the clock down at the end. The referee obliged and blew his whistle. And quite rightly so. They're now on the halfway line celebrating with all their teammates. I'm pretty sure all the subs, etc., will come running on as well. A great, great night for this football club. That's a party to last throughout the year, I should think. to be celebrating good times in the Europa League and now the trophy awaits them well all those months of hard training sessions pre-season training you kind of look forward to get yourself through those sessions and they'll be looking forward at moments like this they've finally got their hands on this fantastic magnificent trophy this is what they've wanted now it's in their possession 
the winners of the UEFA Europa League. Long celebrations into the night, I'm pretty sure, Derek. It's going to go on and on. Yeah, I think they have every intention of making this last as long as possible. One more trophy left, why not? Yes. Well, this is the moment I love, sharing it with the fans. The ticker tape's coming down, the family's in the stand, giving them all a wave. Well, they've travelled all over Europe watching this team. Now they get to share in this moment. Fantastic.